All right. Well, hello there. It is Wednesday, April 24th, which means it is double sale Wednesday with Jen and our guest Kim from Oh My Vintage. Uh, so the morning sale has wrapped up. Uh, that was, that was such a fun sale. So much laughing because yes, I in particular <laughs> had a scotcheroo for breakfast. Lots of sugar, lots and lots of sugar in that, <laughs> which has been helping because I've gotten the postage done this morning. It's all by the front door. I've got the table organized, although with the Wednesday sale, it's a little easier to wrangle in the table and get it all nice and organized. Uh, but let's go ahead and talk about the sale. Uh, I brought in uh, 10 items, 10 items to the morning sale. Then we're going to bring 10 items to the afternoon sale. So be sure and um, stay tuned because um, this is the buy it now portion of the video. And there'll be another buy it now portion of the video for any items remaining after the afternoon sale. Uh, of the 10 items that I brought, I sold nine of them. So thank you. Thank you very much for your purchases. Um, but let's go ahead and look at the one item that is still available. And it is this little mini set of bottles. Now this bottle is about two inches tall. This bottle is about one inch tall. You can see this one is a little um, uh, narrower. This one is a little wider. I originally thought these were glass when I first was handling them this morning. I think they're plastic. They're a really thick, they're really thick, but my house is cold enough that they should have a little coolness to them. There's no seam that I can tell on these, which does make it a little harder, but after handling them for a bit, I think I'm still going to stick with plastic. I originally had these priced at $6 because I thought they were glass. Um, now in thinking after the sale because of them being plastic, I think I'm going to lower it to $4. So $4 for the four little bottles. And if you're interested in purchasing, uh, send me an email or uh, leave a comment down below. And let's go ahead and take a look at the nine items that sold. I had two rocks. This is a yellow aventurine. And this is a tiger's eye. A brass bell from India. Got a nice ring to it. Uh, this was a really nice piece. It's from Korea. It has all this beautiful mother of pearl. And it was a 50th anniversary of some Korean education. There's a little, there it is right there. I'll try not to blind everybody with the light. And it is a card holder. But isn't that gorgeous? Let me see. My camera couldn't quite focus in on the figures. Let me put that down. Uh, there was just so much glare. Let me see if this camera can focus in. I think it is musicians and dancers. That's beautiful. Uh, this item and this item actually went together. A little Starbucks heart and a heart trivet that you can also hang on the wall. I have these glass balls in here that have... Um, like a little a coating on them to make them, you know, show off all the colors of the rainbow. Uh, but because they're balls, they want to roll around. So I have them in here to kind of wrangle them in. Uh, this was a fun piece. It looks like a little origami piece all folded, but it's a little porcelain piece. A set of five um, copper coasters. And this wood sign, really fun farmhouse look. Come gather at our table. 
All right, so those are the nine items. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and take you over to the front door and we'll talk about the mail. All right, well, I am up by the front door. I have got six boxes going out today. Let me switch this around and I will show you. There's two, there's two boxes, and then there are two more boxes right there. All right, I'm gonna flip this back around. Um, all right, I did a count. That means that I do still have 12 boxes uh, that I am awaiting payment. Um, I've only got about, about an hour before the next sale starts, um, but I did already have some lunch, so I'm, I'm good to go there. I do have to get Joe and Faye, the kitties, some lunch before the next sale starts. Uh, but I am next going to be, um, oh, I was going to say, I'll, fin I'll finish one thought before I go on to the next. I was going to say I've got about an hour, so I will keep checking for payments. If I get any more payments in, uh, then I will add them to the stack and I'll let you know. Um, but I am going to go clear off the table, get the sold items upstairs and uh, tuck away that unsold item uh, so I can still get to it just in case somebody would like it. And then I'm gonna set up for the afternoon sale. So next, I will either see you if I add any more packages to the outgoing mail, or I will see you after the sale. All right, well, it is almost four o'clock, which means that the afternoon sale has wrapped up. The mail carrier was here and picked up the mail, so that was awesome. Uh, getting things done today. Uh, so a big thank you to Kim from Oh My Vintage for hanging out with Jen and myself today for our double sale. Uh, let's see, for the afternoon sale, we brought 10 items. I sold four of the items which means that six items are still available. Let's go ahead and take a look at those six items. There we go, flip the camera around, and let's see, I'm gonna go down my list. So I have this little ceramic zebra uh, tea light holder. He does have little legs, super cute little zebra. He is $6. This is a Nippon plate. Uh, that means that this was made in Japan uh, prior to 1921. So it is a true antique over a hundred years old. It is hand painted seven inch plate with a beautiful blue border. That is $7. This little shoe says Tulips from Amsterdam, Holland. It is done in um, beautiful Delft print, uh, painting. So it is, it looks like a wood shoe, but it is a little ceramic shoe, like a little planter. And that one is uh, $7. A beautiful four by six inch tile with, I'm going to say blueberries painted on it. It does have felt on the back. Now, if you wanted to use that as a tile, you could take the felt off, um, but it is ready to be used as a hot pad or just a decorative piece. And the tile is uh, $8. Uh, this little puppy, he is a stone carved puppy. There is his little tail in the back. He got big ears, and I'll try to get in close there with the light so you can see his face. I'm not sure what kind of a stone this is. It's kind of a pinkish brown stone, and he is $12. And then I have this beautiful Mexican pottery hand-painted And 
I'll spin it around this way. Got a beautiful blue handle, blue painting around the top and the spout. And this picture is $12. Um, all right, so let's go ahead and take a look at the four items that sold. I have this little red, white, and blue uh, glass ornaments in icicle shapes. A little stone carved bunny. This is very pretty iridescence and I think if I hold this up to the light, oh yeah, you'll be able to see that beautiful glow from the bunny. Isn't that gorgeous? Uh, then I have, this is a fun piece, the left-handed pitcher. So, yep, this is my left hand. If you're left-handed, you pour it like that. And you can put cream or syrup in there. And then this beautiful cobalt blue jar. This piece is in outstanding condition. <coughs> All right, uh, so those are the, I'm trying to get the lid back on. There we go. The four items that sold. Let me flip this back around. Okay, I am going to get the sold items upstairs because that's where I'll be working tomorrow. Maybe part of tonight too. Uh, upstairs packing and invoicing. Uh, the still available items, well, I'll keep them down here in handy. So as people watch the speed round, as people watch the vlog, if anyone's interested in purchasing anything, you can let me know and I can find it easily. Um, I've got some of the items already here pulled for tomorrow's sale. I'm just going to get them organized and uh, moved over onto table. So it's easier for me to kind of group things together and, um, and yeah, pull the sale together tomorrow. Uh, we'll see how that goes. Um, but that is pretty much going to do it for me today. Uh, so thank you so much for watching and I will see you tomorrow.